Okay, everybody wants to know how to make a slopey wall. So we're going to open up Revit Architecture and we're going to go to the Massing and Site tab. We're going to turn on so we can see Show Mass, Form, and Floors. And we're going to pick an in place mass. It's going to give it a name. Mass 1 is okay. And I'm in a level 1 view and I got my sketch tools and I'm just going to use a rectangle. And that light blue square is my work plane. So I'm just going to draw a rectangle. Maybe you want your wall to be um, 8 meters long. Go to a default 3D view so you can see it. that's the shape on the ground floor. Okay, select all of that and go up to Form, Create Form. It popped it up. Uh, 2438. Maybe you want your wall to be 4 meters. Okay, and now um, it's selecting the top face right now. If you select that one, that one, so you'll see the there's an edge. Okay, so I want the, um, the whole face. And I'm going to drag on the green axis. Okay, there's a nice sloped wall, only it's a mass. So then you say finish mass. Then you go to the massing and site tab and pick wall by face. Go over to properties and pick a wall. I'm just going to use brick on metal stud. And when you see the face you want to be your wall light up, you click on it and it's turned it into um, a brick wall. So now you have a brick wall and a mass. So I'm just going to select my mass object and move it. Just going to filter that out. Okay, pick move. I'm moving it over there. And so now I have a mass and a wall. I actually did it twice. Okay, so there you have how to make a slopey wall. Oops, I got the bricks on the wrong side. Okay, so there is your sloping brick wall. That's it.